Namaste. Welcome back to Project Geetha's Deep Learning Series. The objective of the Deep Learning Series is to introduce every verse of the Bhagavad Gita in a digestible manner. As part of this initiative, we were discussing the first verse of the first chapter. Dhritarashtra Uvacha Dharma Kshetre Kuru Kshetre Samaveta Yuyutsavaha Mamakaf Pandavash Chaiva Kimakurvata Sanjaya Last week we have seen that the first verse of the Gita was an instruction to introspect and see what is happening in and around us. This was illustrated through the question of a blind old king, Tridharashtra, to an impartial reporter, Sanjaya, to understand what is happening in the battlefield of Kurukshetra. The beauty of the Gita is that it offers a subjective interpretation of its verses. Today we will discuss the subjective meaning and the symbolisms of the verse 1 of the Gita. We need to understand that the Gita is a body of knowledge that leads us to the best version of our life. In this journey, fine-tuning of our mind is the key requirement. We need to look into what is happening in our mind and keep it pure, calm and controlled. As is the mind, so is the man. If the mind is not pure, calm and controlled, we cannot experience the happiness and be efficient in our activities. Our mental state at a given time is determined by the dominating thoughts and emotions in the mind at that time. Typically our mind is blind to what is happening within. The first verse of the Bhagavad Gita is an instruction by the blind mind to the honest introspection to see what is happening. This honest introspection will tell us what is happening inside our mind and how the positive forces such as self-control, love and devotion surrender to the lower values such as pride, anger, jealousy, etc. Without this self-analysis, we will not be able to make any positive changes in our life. Tritharashtra in the first verse literally means the one who is attached to the kingdom of the body. Symbolically, he represents the blind mind attached to negative emotions. Destructive emotions are born of a mind that is blind to the discrimination and spiritual wisdom. Sanjaya literally means the one who is completely victorious. This faithful reporter represents the honest introspection or self-analysis within. Kauravas and Pandavas represents the negative and positive thoughts and emotions in our mind respectively. So the opening verse of the Gita starts with an instruction from our blind mind Tritarashtra to do an honest introspection Sanjaya to find out what is happening in the internal battlefield of our own mind. The intent is to examine our mind from within and understand the forces that controls our mind. This includes the type of thoughts, emotions, events that trigger various thoughts and emotions, feeling we experience from our perception and responses to the situation. This instruction of the Gita is very important 
as the identification of the problem is the first step towards the solution. We will discuss some of the practices related to this verse in our Gita Sadhana segment. Thank you very much for watching and next week we will discuss the second verse of the first chapter. Please contact us if you have any questions. Thank you very much and happy